Welcome everybody to our weekly webinar. I'm so excited. I am Debbie Perez Cockburn. Um, and as usual, joining me this week is our president and founder of CEO, uh, founder and CEO of Soul Naturals, Greg Halliday. It's always a happy, happy day when we can have Greg with us and exciting that, that you can all be with us. I love sharing with all of you and um, it's, it's just such a pleasure. Um, to, to be with you this week. I am excited because last week we spoke about two of the, the favorite products that I have in the balance category. Um, that was Adaptable and Soul Vital. They really are the backbone of the company. They're the two founding products that Soul was started with. And so I was excited to do that. We're going to um, talk about two other products in the balance category this week. We're going to talk about Soulflex PI and the Soulflex AC cream. I'm not really going to go into a lot of detail on the AC cream, except to tell you just a few of the things that it contains and why it is for me so important. And then the other products that are left to talk about in the balance category next week will be Thrive, uh, which is now called Avant Greens. And we're excited about the name change, the, the size of the bag change, and the price adjustment on that. And so Greg will be telling us more of the ins and outs about Thrive next week. That's a product that I love and I love learning about because I don't really know all of the ins and outs about Thrive, but I will have slide um, presentation for you on that as well. And then we'll talk about the oils that are left in the balance category and we'll be done with balance um, in this month. And the next month, we're going to talk about um, one of the, the larger categories at Seoul, which is the Clarify line. And I love that because in the Clarify line, we have a lot of products. So I'm going to share my screen here quickly and um, see if I can find what I wanted to show you. So we're going to, can everybody see this? Does, does everybody see my screen? Perfect. Okay. Thanks, Greg. So Soulflex cream, and I just heard somebody else join in. So welcome, welcome. Soulflex cream is one of my favorite things to talk about. Hey, there's Victoria. Hi, Victoria. So the Soulflex AC cream to me is just um, a vital product. Everybody should have AC cream and the essential oils available. Of course, you should have, according to me, all of Soul Naturals products available to you at all times. But I love the AC cream because of um, many, many things. Oops, I pulled up the, the wrong one, but it doesn't matter. Um, I love the AC cream because AC cream has Arnica and Calendula in it. And we both know those herbs to be very healing herbs. Um, and those are the, um, well, Arnica is the first ingredient that you will see on the label. And then after that, you will see um, olive leaf. And then calendula actually comes a little farther down the, the line. Um, but so many amazing ingredients in the AC cream. And I just wanted to share a personal story, a personal testimonial about AC cream. And some of you know that I had Achilles tendon um, surgery close to about three years ago, I want to say. And um, usually that's a surgery that will take. And the doctor said to me, I wouldn't expect anything really in, a big to happen for you between 18 and 24 months. And I thought, I don't have 18 to 24 months to heal. I really don't have a lot of this um, patience that people talk about, even though I was taking adaptable. Um, but for the first 10 days after the surgery, I was non-weight bearing. I was um, bedridden for 10 days. I had a little scooter that I fell off a few times. My husband knows he hated that thing. Um, but as soon as the doctor said, you can get into a shower and sit, you can apply cream. And uh, one of the things that I did was I started using the AC cream. I started taking the uh, Soul Megas, the, the Soul Flex PI that we're gonna talk about in a little bit. and um, and I started applying that with the essential oils, not directly on the area, but as soon as the stitches were off, I could actually apply it and massage it. And when I started going to my physical therapist and when I went back to see the surgeon, the surgeon was really uh, impressed by how nice my foot looked. And I should have pulled up the picture of my foot 
so that you could see it. And I'll show it to you next time, maybe if we have time. Um, but just there was so minimal bruising. There was um, really, if you look at my foot today, there's not a lot of a scar left. And my physical therapist actually was impressed at how quickly I was healing and how quickly the swelling had gone down. So um, topically, I was applying the Soulflex AC cream. Internally, I was taking quite a bit of this product right here, which is the Soulflex PI. And one of the things that I love about Soulflex PI is the very first ingredient. So if you can see the screen, you can see that one of the very first things it contains and the, the, the herb in the largest quantity in this product, that's why it's number one, that's why it's listed number one, is Chinese skull cap. And then after that, we have the Boswellia serrata, you know that as um, frankincense, right? Uh, we've got curcumin, and turmeric, magnolia bark, myrgum, noni extract, grape seed extract, you'll recognize some of these herbs as being adaptogenic herbs. Some of them are anti-inflammatory herbs. Um, you will also see um, some of these herbs are super high in antioxidants. And so it was really no miracle, well, maybe something short of a miracle to see my foot heal so quickly after that surgery. And I have to tell you, that after I started physical therapy and was doing this program of these products, um, my doctor saw me at the six month mark and I was walking without a cane. I wasn't using anything. I wasn't even in a boot anymore. And I was doing some exercises that really proved that my balance had improved greatly on that foot. And he just looked at me, he said, I must be a really great surgeon. And I said, well, you are a very good surgeon, but I take some amazing herbs <laughs> and Heavenly Father really loves me. So I think if you add all three of those things together, then yes, you are a good surgeon. And we kind of joked about it, but he really was amazed. And he, he had to ask me a few times, what's in that product that you're taking? What's that cream that you're taking? Because my physical therapist actually called him and then called me. And that's how I got one of my new customers was that my physical therapist started recommending Soulflex AC cream to a lot of people. So I don't know if you knew that story, Greg, but I thought it was really kind of fun. Um, and uh, there's, a, there's something in Dr. Allison's book that I really, really loved and which is where I want to focus our discussion today. Uh, Greg is going to tell us about um, Chinese skullcap and why we use it and what was the reasoning behind um, including so many adaptogenic herbs in an anti-inflammatory uh, product, something for inflammation and pain. For those of you who are new and don't know, Soulflex PI, P stands for pain, I stands for inflammation. Um, this, this statement, if you can see my screen right now, this statement was the one that struck me the most. And you know, um, I love this book. I love Dr. Allison. I love the studies that have been that have been used in her research uh, for consulting at Seoul and coming up with some of these uh, products. But um, in her book, she talks about that there's a lot of science behind depression being linked to inflammation in the body, and so that's why Chinese skull cap is so important as part of our formula, Soflex PI. And Greg, if you wouldn't mind unmuting yourself now and telling us a little bit um, of the why, the how it came to be, and I will be quiet. You bet. <clears throat> Deb, if you, I actually love this slide, but do you think you could jump to the one that had the ingredients too? Just so I can, because <clears throat> maybe there's a comment or two <clears throat> on some of these other ones too. <clears throat> So the Chinese skullcap was a brand new herb to me, even though, you know, all those, all my 20 years at, at the past company, I had not heard of it. It's, uh, you sometimes see it as scutellaria, starts with an S, scutellaria, or sometimes there are products that are called Baikalin, B-A-I-C-A-L-I-N, I think, Baikalin, but Baikalin, and they'll say, oh, that's Chinese skullcap. It's only one little part of it. It's one of the active components, there are many, but they found that that bicolin really helps with inflammation, so they, they do what they do. 
right? In labs, they pull, they try to take one piece out of it and, and concentrate it up. And yeah, people do news, <clears throat> notice a difference in inflammation with it, but we really want the other elements because there are several other components that also work on inflammation in a different way. And I do believe what Debbie said. I think that stress and you know feeling down comes and goes to all of us where it stays and it's hard to get rid of. You know, that's a harder thing. That's more of a diagnosed depression. That, that causes inflammation and is caused by inflammation. I think it's a circle. And so anything that we can do, and that's why we have seven things in here. Debbie wanted me to mostly focus on the top one, but they all work differently. And we receive things differently, right? And, and things change in our body and in our life. And different things work a little better at different times. That's what we've found. And so um, when things change, we've got seven things in there. The Chinese skull cap is number one, like Debbie said, a little secret on the labels of soul. When you see a little herbal silhouette, you know, like this little, I don't know if you can see my little arrow. Does it show my arrow since I'm not sharing my screen when I, it probably doesn't, but the little, the little white herbal silhouette on the label, that's almost always the herb that is the featured um, ingredient and the one of highest content in the formula. So that's Chinese skull cap. And Mark Pedersen, you remember Mark who wrote Nutritional Herbology, both those? He actually, we had been working with him on Soul Vital. And it's the reason our work with him is the reason why we changed our minds and did not sell Soul Vital as a, as a pre prepared drink in a liquid form. That was our original plan. And uh, what he showed us about degradation of most anything within 48 hours, um, you're, you get single digit percentage potency on a lot of active components within 48 hours. So if you can keep them in a powder and mix them, then when you use them, that's why you'll use things that you're maybe used to in the past with soul and you'll go, wow, I'm noticing a lot more. And so we chose to go with the powder because of potency issues. Well, this, this one, he was working on the side. He had another formula and it included these er several of these herbs and some others. And we talked to him about our adaptogen-based philosophy and plant-based. So he had a couple of things in a formula that were um, synthetic. Uh, synthetic. They were natural compounds, but they were produced synthetically. That sounds weird to say, but there's a lot of that go that goes on in the industry. And we didn't want that. We wanted all natural. And that's why we came up with these seven. So the Chinese skull cap is, is actually a quite a, a powerful concentrate of the plant. It includes all of the active components. The Boswellia serrata, <clears throat> you know, that's one of the, very, the varieties of frankincense. Um, we chose that particular variety because we felt like it was best. For inflammation. The curcumin in there is actually standardized turmeric. So I wanted you to know it has all of the turmeric in there, but curcumin it gets a lot of attention being extra good. Um, it is the pigment, right? It's that yellow pigment in the turmeric. <clears throat> and it, um, there's, there's variation in the turmeric on how much color and so we wanted to standardize so that you know you've got an amount, this a strong amount of the curcumin. So uh, for if you're really into kind of that, there were a lot of brain issues that go on there. Debbie's probably going to teach all this, so I won't say much about them. But I just wanted you to know mostly that some of these are concentrates. They're not just a little bit of powder. So like the noni, um, Debbie probably remembers this. The noni, do you know that's that's a four serving. Uh, amount of noni we put in there. It's actually a full serving, but then a four times concentrate of the whole fruit. So it has the rind in it as well. So I just wanted you to know that's the reason why Debbie, when she talks about, you know, this and this and this and surprising this and so and so was surprised about that. Um, we just, we use concentrates. I think I've mentioned that, but we use, when we use them, we use them in all the balance. We try to keep the balance. And so we don't like to pull them out. Um, even if we do standardize stump something, we keep the rest of the plant. So that, so it's a good amount of everything. The myrrh, all of it is a good full serving, okay? 
it's not just like a little sprinkle of it. And so if, if you know people who are used to using one or more of those, they'll get the same result but th that they would get in the other, in, in their other, with a much smaller amount in ours because of the amount that we put in there. Um, but yeah, I would, I would say um, the top ingredient, my last comment I guess I'll just add today is that top ingredient, the Chinese skullcap, the scutellaria, um, you don't see it a lot in the marketplace because several pharmaceutical companies have, have bought it up and taken the rights to higher extract amounts. So they're trying to kind of make it more and more. It's natural, but I, to me, when you go too far, you make it kind of drug-like. You can do that to any plant. And um, that's why it's not super well known. You can find it, but it's not common. This this material that we use is a really good concentrate, but it's still at the level where you're getting the whole benefit of the plant. I've never in my in all of my years, it's about 30 years now, I've never seen anything that works like this and it's so gentle, any age, person of any age, um, you can use the amount you need. So I know people, just one, they'll start off with one and see what they feel, one every day, and then you kind of build and see what changes and then once you get to a level where you see a lot of change you can back down again to that level that you keep every day but people that have bigger issues of pain like debbie said it could be an injury it could be like, like migraine type stuff um it's the kind of thing that a person can say yeah I'll, I'll take three of those every two hours every four hours for a couple of days while they're going through something or several days um and there's just not a problem with it it's um, so that's what I love about it. All the ingredients can be used in the quantities that you need. And so don't be afraid to use them when you have like an intense situation because you, you'll back off when you get it, when you get it right, you know, when it gets balanced again. I don't know, Deb, any other comments that you wanted to make about those or any other? You know what? I, 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 I'm always so fascinated listening to you, Greg, and just getting the background on all of it. I guess all of us are really good herbalists, right? We, we've grown up with this stuff and we know the attributes of each herb. Um, and it's like you say, you know, it's not just this little smattering of an herb, you know, it's not just a little bit of powder. It is some highly concentrated. And I think you said on the Noni, it was four, uh, four, four times. Yeah. Actually, um, I looking back at some of the slides, I, I think what's five, <laughs> five, oh, five yeah. times yeah. concentrated the, the fruit extract and the rind, um, which yeah. is really important because it's like you say, you know, we can get a noni in a drink. We can get noni in a capsule, but you're not getting five times the serving in that capsule or in that drink. You're getting a diluted form, something that will become degraded over time, because I don't know anybody, I, I tried it once. I tried to go glove down a bottle of Noni and got, got sick um, because I felt like I really needed it. Did I ever tell you this story, Greg? I was on my way for some regional meetings. My dog broke my nose, he fractured my nose over the weekend and I was flying out on Monday. When the dog hit me, I tried drinking down a whole bottle of noni just to get the inflammation down. And of course, the inflammation did come down quite a bit, but I got really bad diarrhea. It's not something that I would highly recommend. And that was the other product from the other company. I think if we'd had something like this and I had taken uh, two capsules like every hour or every two hour, I probably would have gotten the same result without the bad side effects that I got from drinking down, guzzling down a whole bag bottle of noni. Um, but it was pretty serious. I remember the dog hit me, knocked me out. When I woke up, my niece was looking at me and she said, are you okay? And I said, hey, how bad is it? Because I heard it crack immediately and then I blacked out. And she goes, well, if you mean how bad is it? Is your nose bigger than it normally is? It's a lot bigger. <laughs> She's <laughs> super swollen. I mean, I had my eyes open. I could see that they were swollen. And it looked like I was looking down at my nose, like it was like this big. I, that's all I could see when I looked down. And when I traveled that week, it was really better. So a testament to these products that you've included in this formula, Greg, to me, uh, it is something really serious because um, you could look at each component individually and say, oh, this is great for this. And why didn't you just come out with this and add this? It's the whole science of 
these products, these ingredients are more than just nutritionally power, uh, powerful fruits and, and, and herbs. They are adaptogenic in, because even though noni is not considered an adaptogen, it sure acts like an adaptogen. Okay. But, Absolutely. You know, or you look at grapeseed extract, which we know has so many um, anti-inflammatory properties because of the resveratrol that it has. And you can find yeah. resveratrol by itself on it's artificial, it's synthetic, you're not gonna get it in this high concentration, and it's not gonna benefit the body as much as it does when it's in a combination like this. And I, this is where I, I know I overuse the, the, the word synergy, but really, if you looked at each product, each individual component of Soulflex PI, and you looked at how powerful it is, like compared to like Mergum, or even if you look at, uh, I, I don't like to, to get a little, too religious here, but um, I'm going to stop the screen share really quick um, and go back to our our panel view. Um, talking talking um, religiously, if you looked at each individual ingredient and what were the 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 gifts that the you know in the in the scriptures talk about that the Savior received, right? The frankincense, the myrrh, and the gold. And you look at um, those three and you, you see how valuable they are. I think um, when you look at um, like spiritual suffering or emotional suffering, that causes inflammation in the body. And when you look at what frankincense can do to alleviate that and what mergum can do to alleviate that, that pain, physical pain, emotional pain, pain is pain. And the body reacts to pain in a certain way. Pain and inflammation are normal immune responses. But when you have an overabundance or an overactive uh, immune um, response, then that's where our body starts to suffer. And so I think of um, Soulflex PI as an amazing gift to humanity, Greg. I think this is one of the most amazing products on the market that you will ever find that you will never find anywhere other than soul naturals in this combination in this formulation in this high concentration and to me that that is really incredible because when you think about people who suffer with chronic illnesses i'm not a doctor i don't diagnose i don't prescribe none of us do but we're all very familiar with how our bodies work and how herbs can help the body and having said that, I think people who suffer from chronic disease or chronic inflammatory disease have severe problems with depression and anxiety mm -hmm. because that's how the body copes with it. And mm -hmm. when we use a product like Soulflex PI, I think um, in my case where I'd had numerous knee surgeries already and when I ruptured my Achilles and had that problem and couldn't walk, to me that was like the end of my world because all of you who know I'm Puerto Rican, I live to dance and I dance to live. And my dancing abilities have been um, shrunk as of late in the years. But the, the, the bright side of that is that I walk without a cane, without knee replacement. And occasionally my knee can forecast the weather. Like I know that Hurricane Sally is close to hitting us because I could feel it today in my knees. So that's, that's kind of the fun thing. Sad that I don't dance as much anymore, but you know what? I'm just so grateful. My personal testimony is that I, I can walk, you know, I can walk and I, I, I am so grateful for that, that I can move. And so that's a great testimony. And then Greg also mentioned other different kinds of pain. Um, I have a niece. Well, she is the wife of my, of my nephew, and she is also in my soul group. Her name is Jessica, and Jessica called me, um, and Greg, you remember this story. Uh, seven years ago, when I started with soul, she called me and said, the doctor has diagnosed our youngest boy as having autism, mm -hmm. and he was one of those children who was in, in the middle of the spectrum. He was, you know, there were some serious signs where all he would do was flap his arms and scream and he couldn't play unless all of his toys were lined up by a certain size, a certain color, and everything had to, he had obsessive compulsive um, disorder as well as the autism. And as the time went by, all she did, all we had seven years ago 
Just <laughs> all Flex PI. We had, you know, the Calm Oil. We had the Soul Megas. We had these products. And I gave her everything that I had. It was Soul Vital, Soul uh, Cinemate, the Soul Flex PI, because I know brain disease is an inflammatory disease. And the, the, the Calm Oil, as well as the Soul Megas and the Vertizymes. And she started using that. And um, within a month, she, she'd seen some severe changes over two weeks. But a month later, her son's physical therapist said, hey, have you noticed that he doesn't scream and flap anymore? Have you noticed that he's not being obsessive compulsive about how he plays? And if you see this child today, he is eight years old, no, nine years old. He just turned nine. And he has his own YouTube channel. And he looks like a TV announcer. You would never, ever in a million years know that this child was ever diagnosed as having autism and not being on the low end of the spectrum, being on the high end of the spectrum. And so I have seen these changes. His mom had been suffering with ovarian cysts. Her OBGYN said, hey, we might want to schedule some surgery for you because she'd been having severe cramping and, and severe menstrual problems. And so she said, well, let me wait. And she, she said, um, Auntie Debbie, what can I take for this? And of course, I told her about our four-month program and, and the products that, that we recommend. And she started using that. And just a month ago, she said to me, you know what? I went back to the OB. She says, guess what? Your ovarian cysts are almost non-existent. What have you been doing? Because the cysts shrunk. And she, she just said, you know, I, I take some really good herbs and she doesn't have the menstrual cramping. She doesn't have the extreme bleeding. She doesn't have the terrible clotting that causes all of that pain. And um, we've seen in our family some amazing stories of, of the body healing itself when you give it the right nutrition, which is what I love about Soul Naturals, which is what I love about Soul Flex PI. You've heard me say it a million times, whether you suffer from, whether you think you have anxiety or stress, it doesn't matter. You probably do, but there's so many other things going on in your life. You haven't noticed that part. Um, Soul Flex is a, is a product that is based on adaptogenic herbs and everyone can use it depending on how much they need. Adaptable is a product that everyone can use every day, regardless of their age, um, little, little children, geriatric people. Um, I love the balance line. I love talking about the balance line of products at, at Soul um, because our bodies are always trying to reach a balance. That's a daily struggle for our body to have balance. We are always trying to reach homeostasis. That's what our bodies were designed to do. If our bodies can be in harmony, all of the organs and the brain working together, then our bodies will function well. We do get older. We don't eat appropriately. And what we eat sometimes is not the best. And that's why good supplementation is important. And I really love these products. And um, I don't know if anybody has a story that they want to share. I know we've been on pretty close to 30 minutes. Or Greg, if you want to say something else, this would be the great time. Deb, you, made, you, made, you reminded me of something. Because I think when we first started talking about Soulflex PI, we talked a lot about the pain and inflammation, P and I, right? Mm -hmm. But I think now, um, I was thinking about it after eight years, when I, like my one sentence description of when you should use it is more, um, look, when you, <laughs> when the issue is, is, some, is about flexibility mm -hmm. of either body or mind. Mm -hmm. And I, because I'm thinking that so many things you think about, okay, is this a situation where it's more rigid, needs more flexibility? whether it's physically, because it can be, um, we didn't talk about this today, but the colon, there's lots of great research on several of those ingredients that will, that, you know, a colon that's, that's more rigid, more constipated, less um, movement limited, um, or inflamed, or even, um, what do you call it, uh, spastic, where it changes, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, you know, from, from one extreme to the other, so to speak. But Soul Flex PI, it is what you say. It's one of those products. It's one of those formulas that we really have Mark to thank for that. Mark Pedersen, Dr. Pedersen, because his core is what got us into kind of those final additions that we made. 
and we knew and he knew it would be a really good but we didn't realize quite what we had until we started using it and but that's what i think i i don't know i think if everyone could look at it as okay this is my my mind flexibility emotional flexibility you know the ability to to receive things as they come and then i i pivot and i i have a healthy response if they don't stick me or freeze me or you know and i'm not talking about a little bit that's that's just life i'm talking about you know ongoing um we it's okay to <laughs> to have things hurt in the moment they're supposed to yeah. you know they, yeah, they, they do whatever <clears throat> but it but the flexibility it it just makes such a huge difference in how we heal and that's what i love about soul greg and um that you have an essential oil blend for each category. Yeah. So when you talk about the Soulflex PI helping you be um, less rigid, like less rigid thinking or less rigid acting in your body, yeah. you add the balance oil or the um, uh, the, the comfort <laughs> oil. Courage. Uh, courage, sorry. Courage yeah. is, is for the balance. Um, courage, yeah. I love the name courage because it really does suggest being flexible like you get over whatever that fear is if you look at chinese philosophy and you and and let's just say we're talking about bones right now or muscular skeletal problems where you have uh painful muscles sore muscles uh, injuries to to your skeleton system um all of those things are related to the kidneys in chinese philosophy right um, and so sometimes you just need that courage and, and you think if there's fear in the body, it reflects in your kidneys. There's fear, any kind of fear, anything that you are hesitant about, that you might be a little bit rigid towards. Just think the way Greg was saying, flexible and non-flexible. If there's anything in your body that feels really tight, you need a little more flexibility. Soul Flex would be that product or the Soul Flex cream or the Courage roll-on oil or the balance oil mixed with uh, the balance blend mixed with the AC cream or something like that. So really, um, let's open our eyes. Let's be a little more flexible. When we look at um, Soul Naturals and its products, I don't like to box anything in and say, like, this is just pain and inflammation. Um, we know any kind of uh, disease that affects the brain, the nervous system, the science proves that that's inflammatory-based. And so um, I don't like to think of my brain getting hard. That's one of the things that um, we know causes Alzheimer's uh, and those things. And um, when we look at the science behind the scutellaria and the Mergum uh, and the Boswellia in particular, we look at, um, and uh, Dr. Allison documents this in her book and the studies that prove, um, that have shown how these can have a really good effect on illnesses like Parkinson's and how it can affect the brain. So please, please, please don't ever think of the products as being just one thing, one little square. Oh, I have it in my mind that this is what I do for this. You know what? I have found with soul that if I have something going on and it's the, I grab the first thing I can, I will find relief in that because my body will know how to use the adaptogenic herbs in it to adapt to whatever other situation it is going through at the moment. And that's what I love about soul. Greg, thanks so much for sharing the information today. I don't know if anybody has any um, comment, story, testimonial, or a quick question that you'd like to ask while Greg is on. But Greg, I know that you have another webinar after this, and I don't wanna keep you. I know that your time is golden. We are so grateful to have you here. But if anybody has a quick question, Speak now or forever hold your peace. Otherwise, we will let Greg go with our immense thanks. And then I will open up the microphones for all of us while we're still recording because our questions could always help someone else. Awesome to see you, honey bun. Gloria. <laughs> and Joanne, Sherry, and you got to tell me the third. I know, Joanne, who's with you? I know it's Sherry and Della. Della. All right, Della. I recognize and then you now. And you remember Victoria, right? Yes. Yep. Awesome. Good, good seeing you all. Thanks for letting me come. I'll Thanks, see you next Greg. week. Greg. See you next week. Bye-bye. Okay, my friends. Well, I am going to unmute everyone. And it should take a second for everyone's microphone to be open.
Uh, does anybody have any questions for me? Not at the moment. This was great. Thank you so much. Is it recorded? Uh, yes, and I will send everyone the recording. Thank, Thank you. you. So if there are no more questions, I'm going to stop the recording right now.